What's up guys, Zalf here back with some more Omnioji and in today's video I'm going to show you guys a basic 5 man team Right, so um, the basic 5 man team consists of Ubume Then we have Kusa as the healer uh, We have Yama Usagi, Yama Usagi, Yama Usagi as the attack bar buffer Then we have Shuzu um, Skills are pretty cool so what she does is this water circuit she connects the water inside the bodies of all allies to form a circuit and the damage is shared among all interconnected units when any of the units receive damage and interconnected allies hp is also restored by five percent of shuzu's hp after the allies turn so as you scale it up um, the damage taken is reduced by five more percent and the duration of the circuit is increased by one more turn after that we have our ever important lighter the zashiki so what she does is um, she has this trade-off skill where she sacrifices 30 percent of her current hp to gain two spirit orbs so orb management is very crucial in this game as the orbs are the one that allows you to do skills so if you want to spam hack and slash from ubume over and over again you need to ensure that every time it's his turn he has to have at least three spirit orbs so we're gonna try this team out I think uh, we're gonna do some souls so let me just no no not souls. sorry <laughs> we're gonna do some evil mat so I'm gonna put this booster up so we're gonna look for evil materials any dungeons that haven't done stage 8 um, cool we can do this Stage 7 of Azure Cup. So as you can see, we have Kusa, we have Shuzu, we have Zashiki, we have Ubumi, Kusa, and Yamausagi. Yamausagi, Yamausagi? I have no idea. Oh, let me just put this on manual. So basically, what, what happens is um, we, we start off with the attack by buffer. Um, then uh, I use Seimei to protect and then we use Shuzu to interconnect everyone and now I'll trade off Zashikis so now we have exactly three orbs for Ubumi to hack and slash right? and then we have a healer to heal if needed so when they do damage to us it's, on, it's shared damage so none of the team dies and the damage is decreased substantially so and then you just repeat the process over and over again right so we put another barrier here connect it again trade off some more so that we get more orbs and we'll just go and hit it so now we can just auto this and they should do the same skills regardless oh no See this thing on auto, it just derps, right? They just use whatever skills they want to use. It's not always the same skill, so it's better on manual. But nobody has time for that. Now, this is just level 7, so they can just auto it just fine. I just haven't done it yet. And yeah, so this is the five man, basic 5-man five team for PvE. And there are more advanced teams. Uh, well, I would say advanced teams. Yeah, there are more advanced teams for souls, etc., where you use specific teams to do it. But for normal dungeons, this should suffice as all these characters are easily farmable. You can get them from the Demon Parade, you can request them from guilds, um, from the guild for the wish, and you can also. You can also let me just show you guys here you can open up the chat go to system right and you can search around for it like there will be like you can see shuzu here like people someone is challenging shuzu and they're requesting others to join you can just tap and join in obviously it depends on your luck to see whether the team is full or not so um you can get shuzu there you can get uh who else can you get there i think you can get shuzu there and there will be some zones where you can get zashiki and stuff so yeah uh, that's it for the basic five men